All right, I gotta make this one a short. This is 1971 Imperial, as you can tell by the grill. All right, 440. You know, look at it. Look how long this front fender is. All right, when this car went into production in 1973, longest production car built because of that front fender right there. All right, now look at this. I've never seen one of these in person. So, this is a LeBaron, which is the top of the line. You know, but you gotta love these teardrop, these teardrop turn signals. Awesome, it's awesome. You know, this one doesn't look like it's been repainted, but the paint does look good for it. It's got some touch-up spots here, around here. So, but see, got that Imperial badge right there on the rear fender. It says the name of the car. See, a car like this has to be driven, man. You know, problem is, you're only going to get like 14 miles a gallon in it. But this is a car that is meant to be driven on the road.